Hey friends, welcome back to my ruckus project, whatever day it is. Uh, I haven't talked to you in a while, it feels like. Um, I am grateful that I chose to give myself 60 days for this rather than 30, so I feel like I can put some spaces between days sometimes. It's working just like I planned. Um, so here I am with my friend who's recovering from surgery and we were talking about the early hopeful signs that she is experiencing and the, the like tension of not wanting to get one's hopes up but feeling hopeful and it because I'm tuned into embarrassment and foolishness um, at the moment uh, my mind went there or my thinking went there um, or I should say I noticed a, a similar a resonance in my body that felt familiar to this project and it, it made me realize the way that hope feels foolish sometimes to let oneself feel hopeful or optimistic about a longed for, a deeply longed for thing. And the more I long for it, the more it feels foolish to let myself hope. Like, to hope is vulnerable. And I don't think that's surprising, but somehow it landed in me in a new way because of the pairing of this project and this experience of being with her for this surgery. I feel grateful to be getting these experiences side by side. Being human is so hard, right? Thanks for being with me, friends. Love ya.